Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. We have already started here. That'll be a throw. Pixie. Weigel. Benfica are seeing a lot of the ball early on, but can they make it tell? Brings it over to the other flank. First quarter of an hour gone. It can only get better, this. We haven't seen a shot yet, and I'm hoping that when we do, it'll spark a whole series of them, because it needs livening up. Great lead! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Crosses it in. Cleared away. Rangers get it back again. He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be out-muscled. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire a commitment like that, because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing, but instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. He goes along. Weigel looking to run onto it. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Anyone is going to break the deadlock, now would be a good time. Weigel gets his foot in there. Forward it goes. Rafa Silva. it out to the wing and that'll be the last act of the first half 
Well, both sides have drawn blanks and have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. How do you review the first half? Yeah, the scoreline doesn't tell the whole story as one side has been significantly better, at least offensively. No goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. The action has already resumed here. Benfica playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half. Despite this scoreline, converting chances would make a world of difference for them. Ruben Diaz plays it forward. Goldson. Steve Davis. Jota. Goal is still. The other side really getting onto the front foot. Rafa Silva, in comes the crook, gets up to head it! And oh, he's got that completely wrong. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. <laughs> Hoists it forward. The right now, what's on? Great run on the overlap here. Beautifully done. Wolf loose. Who's getting there? Pixie. Benfica getting a lot of touches here, but they're not making much progress. Just wouldn't be beaten there. He's come loose. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Rafa Silva tries to get it forward quickly. Very few chances to talk of, Jim. Defence is, it seems, on top here. Yes, nil-nil and little promise of a goal due to the shot-shy nature of this contest, but... I'm not giving up on it, there's plenty of energy on the pitch, not to give up hope just yet. He's left his man, Carlos Vinicius. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. He's tried one. His reputation is better than what we've just seen. Rafa Silva. Rafa Silva drives it forward. And he's cut it out. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. There's a long ball. He's had a go! Big relief, it just needed better contact. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honour shift. Back into the middle. 
Well positioned to make that interception. Pizzi. Looking for space out wide. Uh, the ball needed to be better there, that's a wasted chance. 90 minutes up, and we will be back for extra time. Well, the scoreline may have a disappointing look about it, Peter, but that's where it ends. I think this game has had a real lively feel, and I'm not ready to give up on it yet.